Now he's making it super dope. We could find any that are down there. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, there's a soft shell, dude. Let's see. Let's see him. Let's see him. Oh. <sighs> what is going on, Kafiros? Welcome back to another video here. Today, we're getting turtles for the pool pond. Some people may ask me, why am I buying all these things if I'm moving to the new house soon? And all this stuff is coming to the new house. So whether I buy it here or buy it at the new house, it don't matter either place I buy it. These ponds right here that are in the ground are the ponds staying with koi fish, goldfish. Things are easy to take care of so that when I'm not here as much, I will always be here. My parents could take care of these fish very easily. Throw some pellets in, throw some flakes in, and you're good. This right here, as you can see, our new turtle just went right into the water from right there. We're gonna show you how we got that one in just a little bit. Enough of the turtle pool talk. Let's head to Mark's Ark and pick out some turtles. <laughs> Davis, yeah. easy on the transition. I know, it's this new teleportation it's thing I got going clean, on. It's, it's something new. Anyway, we're here at Mark's Ark. Take a quick peek to your left here. Clown Nightfish, chilling in the plant tank. Actually, he was rehabilitating, if that's the word. That's the word, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I'm a, okay, all right. He's all healed up now since the last time I've been here, so it looks like he's doing just fine, but this tank, this is the one I wanted to show you. This only had cichlids in it last time. Now he's making it super dope. We got jag cichlids, jaguar cichlids. Eventually, I do want one of those fish. Um, I want every fish in the world though, so that's not gonna work out. Oscar, little tiger Oscar there. Also an albino over there. And uh, another jag up here, another tiger. Look at him, I love their Looks lips. Looks like a Midas almost. Yes, yeah, love their lips. We came here today for this reason, though. Right here. You know, we've done this multiple times. There's one I can already see that I really want, and it's him right there. He can grow really fast in the backyard. I don't exactly know how much he is, nor what kind of turtle he is, because I'm not the biggest reptile guy. I just like turtles. There's also a snapping turtle right here, which would be really cool, but Nick already has one, and once it outgrows his tank, I'm gonna put it into my pool pond, so I don't need one of those either. Um, I don't see any yellow bellies, which is this fellow right here. I don't see any of them that are big enough to go into the pool pond without getting like stolen by a bird or like, you, you know what I mean. Bottom line is, there's not many bigger turtles besides this one right here and if we could find any that are down there. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, there's a soft shell, dude. That's sick. Yo, we're gonna get the soft shell too. Yeah, do it. Because we, we haven't got a soft shell yet and in the new place, once we get this pool pond into the new place, I'm actually putting sand in there, which will then the, have the turtles will be loving where they They're are. They're gonna dig they can, all inside They it. can dig inside. So that's their main goal. I think I like steps inside my head. Davis, look at these porcupine puffers right here. Oh, how gosh. cool are those? Like you Dude, can you actually get take, one of those. That's you so get sick. Water, though. Uh -huh. you could, yeah, you can actually take a picture of one of those. I can guarantee and make it look raw. But uh, that's a porcupine puffer. And when they puff up, it's like, <laughs> and they look like this. All right, he's going in. There it is, right there. Right there. Oh, see him? Oh yeah. Don't post it when I scream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got him. And you got another turtle with him. That's a perfect size though. The soft shell. The soft shell ain't too, uh, ain't too small. Yo, can we please just acknowledge the homie hanging on right here? Where? Oh my god. Like <laughs> hanging on the side of a plastic. By one arm. Tree. Yeah. Savage. My boy's a savage. We're just getting the one soft shell today. It's the only turtle that I think is big enough to survive out there outside. Once we get him inside like what I want to have them in at the new house, we can get his, I don't want to spoil anything, dude. Let's just go, we got a soft shell. <laughs> and uh, it's perfect size. <laughs> He's like, I want to bite the lens. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> want to get yourself some pets, some fish, whatever you want. There you go, screenshot real quick. There it is. <sighs> wow, it's beautiful out, dude. It is no. so nice out. We got our little soft shell. We are going to go home and put him into the pond. Such a pretty, and his shell feels so weird. It's like a soft, smooth feel to it. But uh, he's ready to go in the pond. Davis, no transition this time. Let's just, Dang it, let's please. Let's just fade, just fade. Okay, all right, slow Fading. fade. Slowly fade. And we're back into the backyard with our bucket and our new soft shell turtle. I mean, the feeling on it, like, let me put this bucket down, is unreal. It is so soft and like smooth, it's not even funny. So like a normal turtle, the shell is hard. There's a reason why this is called the soft shell. Look at you could literally like fold it, see that? Don't fold it all the way, but it's very bendable, flexible, moves a little bit, see how squishy? It's like a pancake, exactly like a pancake. The edges feel like a pancake, feel that, Davis. Holy moly. The other side. That's so sick. Does he have a soft nose, too? Yeah, his nose is soft, look. Huh. Everything's soft about him. Yeah, he's a liar, though. 
Oh, I get it. <laughs> we are now ready to put our soft shell in the pond. Before we do so, comment down below. What should we name this turtle? Look at this. He's very snippy. We're gonna put him in. Be sure. Comment down below. There he is. How long do you think it's gonna take for him to get off? The uh, other turtles have took a pretty long time. Come on. Oh, hey! Oh. There he goes. Oh wow, he swims really cool too. There he is. And then the albinos right there. So now they're just chilling next to each other. Doesn't it look like a pancake with a neck? So funny. Anyway, so now we have Painted Turtle. You can see why it's called Painted. I've mentioned this multiple times on the channel, but this is a beautiful, beautiful turtle right there. So we got that guy in here. We also got an albino, ready your slider, which you just saw swimming with our new soft shell. So this is what we bought at Mark's Ark last time. As you know, it was much smaller when we bought it at Mark's Ark. They've grown a little bit. But that is the yellow belly. You can see where they get their name. Such a cool looking turtle right there. Very wide, see how wide that turtle is? And uh, there's two of them in here. One's a little bit bigger than this, I believe. So we're gonna put him back. Watch how fast he takes off. He's not the fan of being on land. Whoop, there he goes. Now there's one more turtle, and I gotta find it. This is the one we bought the other day. Come here, buddy. This is a side neck turtle. See his neck? Instead of going straight in like most turtles, they pull it to the side and they push it sideways. I'm getting turtles all at about this size and a little bit smaller, just so they grow in this pond right here. I don't want to buy any huge turtles and I don't want to buy any too small. I'm buying them all at this about this size. And I have the footage of actually getting this exact turtle. So, roll the footage. Anything about a new pet? I'm running off an hour of sleep right now, so... Let's see. Let's see him. Let's see him. Oh! Oh, where's his head? Other way. Hey, buddy! Daddy Long! Oh, he's cute, man. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, here we go. We're gonna put Side him on neck, this. put him on there and let him run off himself. Ready? Oh, come on. He's so, so cute. cute. All right, start naming him. Name down below. Daddy long neck. Comments Daddy long neck. Come on. The new side neck. We're going to kind of keep our distance. Keep our distance. Yeah, Let's see. Yeah. Yeah. He's a little shy. Just, he's just. Lulu, what are you doing outside? His neck's oh, slowly he's coming he's out. He's, he's like, what is this? Look how good the yard looks, dude. We just flattened all the dirt out. So now it's all flat. Pigs are loving it, but as you can see, it looks neat. Very clean, clean, clean backyard now. Oh, look, 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 he's moving. Oh, 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 there he goes. Oh, wow, his neck is really long. Yeah, daddy. <laughs> so long, fella. We'll get more clips of you shortly. But now back with our side neck turned on, I want to give you guys a cool look at the neck. So I'm going to put him down and watch as he gets out and goes into the water. His neck will extend. We don't have a name for him just yet. Who knows what we'll name it? I have no idea. Start dropping names for this fella as well. If we like your comment, there's a lot of likes on it. If I enjoy the comment, I like the name, I'll put you in one of these upcoming videos on the screen. You can see him better. There he goes. See his neck? How, it's, how it extends? Instead of that neck going like this, it's going like this. Look at our soft shell. Now, for those of you who don't know about how this was created, just click up here and you can watch the video of us creating this. They actually used to live in a really small, like, little closed-in aquarium over there, which has now turned into that, but I moved them into this bigger enclosure, not only so I can get more turtles, but so they had a bigger living space. They bask on this one in the morning, because the sun actually comes off this corner here, and they just sit on that corner right there. And then this is on, of course, throughout the whole entire day, every day, mostly at night, though. This is just a bunch of boulders left over from building these backyard ponds, like that one, oh wow, that's bright. Like that one over there, and the two more that are over here. Just got some solar panel lily pads right here, which turn on at night. I put a bunch of artificial uh, plants in there. You can get those at any pet store. Just to make it more realistic, as you can tell, the soft shell was just in them and they're just chilling right there on the rock. Makes it look really good. And then over here is of course our pump. This is just a UV filter and then real live plant. They love that thing. You have to have some sort of live plant that they could sit in. As I speak, you can see the painted hiding up in there right there. And then one just boulder down there. I just put that there just because why not? But that right there is the turtle pool pond what they're in right now. If you want to see it all go down, once again, just watch that video. I'll also have a link in the description. Today's positive comment shout out goes out to Aaron Corey. Love all your videos. Keep up the good work. It's got four likes on it, including myself. If you want to win a positive comment shout out and have your comment pop up in one of these upcoming videos, all you got to do is drop a positive comment down in the comments below. There's three things you can comment about. Two turtle names and your positive comment to possibly in one of these upcoming videos. If you haven't done so already, join the family. Check out some more of the videos. We've got this over here. we got two more big ponds over here. A catfish pond, a whole entire tank room on the inside of the house. A lot to see here. And we just bought a new house that we will be doing a lot of videos 
in here shortly. So be sure, hit the subscribe button. Don't miss out.